Hello everyone, uh, I'm back. I uh, hope you all had a good Christmas um, and a fantastic Christmas. Uh, today I'm actually going to be redoing um, my Remus Looping Wand video because I had to take it down because I didn't like the original. Uh, but we're not only doing my Remus Looping Wand video, but we are actually doing the Lucius Malfoy Walking Stick Wand because I only got this on Christmas, um, New Year's Eve and um, I never had the time that day to do a YouTube uh, a video for it, so here we are today. Uh, now, with Lucius Malfoy's wand, we've actually completed all the Malfoy ones, so we will actually um, do the other Malfoy family members as well, so that we don't, so we can compare them all together. Um, but for now, we will talk about Remus Lupin. Now, it comes in a green box, like the olive green. Um, Remus Lupin is one of my actual like, favourite characters because of... Um, just how he, just how they use him in the movies and that. I used to be scared of the fact that he turned into a werewolf in The Prisoner of Azkaban. Because uh, I was only like a little kid when I first saw that movie. And I'm 17 now. Uh, so this is Remus Lupin's wand. It's got like a ball on the end because it was like... Kind of reminds me of like the moon a little. Like cause, because obviously he looked at the moon and turns into a werewolf. He holds the wand like this. I'm actually right-handed. I just knocked my camera then. But yeah, it's a really nice one. It's got like um, focus. It needs to focus. It's got like little bumps on the um, the handle here. So yeah. Really, really nice one. This is the second of the Marauders ones I've got as well because I have Sirius Black's one. Uh, but yeah. Um, really enjoyed that. Uh, really enjoyed getting that one. Um, yeah. So that is Remus Lupin's wand. Um, there's not really much to talk about this wand as because I actually want to get to my newer wand, which is uh, Lucius Malfoy's wand. So let's move that off to the side. So here we are with Lucius Malfoy. Now this is really really long wand. So the snake head. This is a really heavy wand as well. This is like proper metal, and they're just not the side of my um, cabinet. So he's got these like teeth here. Like these these fangs here, and he's got the um like an emerald bit uh, like bead in the eye here at both sides. Then he has a uh, got these like little like ridges. No, I see Malfoy has these on these on her um the handle for her wand, and she has like smaller versions of these little like brackets as well. And this is the whole wand here. This is the walking stick. So then, what we do is we get, let me get the wand out like that. So yeah, this wand is this wand is quite a fairly big wand in my opinion. It's quite heavy as well. Uh, I did uh, my mum, uh, me and my mum are like really big Harry Potter fans, and when uh, my mum came to hold the wand, she couldn't hold it because like the weight of the wand is just yeah she was like it's well heavy i'm like it's not really but fair enough um yeah it's a really really one of my favorite ones now so it's so heavy uh it's got these two ridges here because the when you slide the wand into the the walking stick it is um Magnetic, so it actually clips in. Now, uh, we are actually going to read the Lucius Malfoy. Um, we have the book here. Um, this video is going to be a little bit longer because we are actually going to find uh, Lucius Malfoy's wand in the book. So, 
these are all the um we'll get to some of their other characters i don't know why gilderoy lockhart's in the book no one cares about him umbridge um people tell me about umbridge um did anyone really like dislike her in the movies i think everyone practically does not like Dolores Umbridge because she's like the most hated character in um, Harry Potter. Now some of these ones I will obviously hopefully be getting like Slughorn, Trelawney, Cedric, um, Fleur de Licor, Victor Crumb, the Sirius Black's one they already have, Nymphadora Tonks is one that I want because obviously she can, she ma she's married to Lupin, Kingsley Shacklebolt, uh, Skip to the what Voldemort. Peter Pettigrew. Now, um, just let me talk about this quickly. This is one of the ones that you can't get in normal collection, but you can only get it with the um, Marauders map set. Now, I wish this did come in a box, one of the um, Ollivanders one boxes for the um, noble collection, because of it. Peter Pettigrew is part of the Harry Potter franchise, and even though you like barely ever uses a wand in the movies. He does have this wand in uh, The Half Blood Prince and Death of Hallows Part 1. So yeah. But he does use Voldemort's wand in um, The Goblet of Fire to kill Cedric with Fenrir Grey back. Corbin Yaxley, no one really knows about him that much because he was only in like, Death of Hallows Part 1 and Part 2 as well. Scabio, his wand is just cool. I like his wand. I have his wand anyway. Uh, Bellatrix was strange. I have a second one. Um, now, if people can put in the comments, can you get Bellatrix was strange's one in an Ollivander one box, or do you just get it on that the plaque? Because I I really want this one in one of the boxes, but um, every time it's come to try and like order Bellatrix's one, it only comes on a plaque. And I'm as much as the plaque looks really nice, I literally have nowhere to put. Um, the plaque or anything, so I, like, I want one of the boxes, then I can just store it in my um, one storage space that I have, and yeah. Sorry, I'm taking so long to find this wand. Where is it? Here we go. Lucy Smalfoy's wand. So, this is the exact same wand. It's a bit different because, um, on the here, this bit is not on the um. The shaft, and um, this the, the wand in the book in this book isn't actually accurate to the movie. This one is because in the movie, if you if you know when um, Voldemort snaps the wand, um, he just uses this bit. And um, I will show you some gimmick later, but it says um, it is actor Jason Isaacs who first asked. Director Chris Columbus, if he, if his character could have a cane, Columbus asked, "Why is there something wrong with your leg?" Isaac replied, "No, I just think it would be good for pointing and gesturing, and I could pull a wand out of it." So it, it is that Lucius's walking stick. I have a um, reading problem, so if I'm quite slow, I do apologise. With its concealed wand became incorporated into his costume for the Harry Potter films. Isaac confesses he thinks this is the coolest wand in the wizarding world. And that it makes his character Lucius Malfoy walk, walk a bit taller. I'll just stop there for now. Um, to be fair, I do think it is one of the coolest ones. I don't think it's the coolest in the wizarding world. Because there's loads of amazing designs of wands and all that out there i don't have a favorite one at the moment this is sort of my favorite because i do just like how heavy the metal handle on that is and um yeah this is just an amazing one there's loads more ones to get now the fantastic beast movies because they are still at the moment um coming out in like cinemas and yeah um the next fantastic beast film isn't actually meant to be coming out till um, 2022 which is next year um, so I'm a bit gutted about that and I'm, a bit, I'm also a bit gutted about the fact that um, Johnny Depp will no longer be playing 
Grindelwald anymore, but I think Mads Mikkelsen might actually be quite a good um, Grindelwald, in my opinion. Yeah. Um, so that's why I'm not getting the Fantastic Beasts ones till after I've complete collected most of the Harry Potter characters. So back to the book. Lucius is known for practicing. Is a known practitioner practitioner of the dark arts with his wand including unforgivable curses he attempted to perform the killing curse on harry on harry in harry potter in the chamber of secrets but his once enslaved house of dobby interfered and repelled him the handle of lucius's wand a fang bearing snake head gleams with emerald gems the color of slithering for its eyes yeah so this is this now, I'm not actually keen on the fact that the wand looks different in the book, but just that, just that, just that thing in it. Um, so we'll close that for now. Let's move that off to the side. So, yeah, um, now there is a thing that you can do with the wand where you just unscrew this. Now, some people might have not known about this bit, but um, I will show you. That is when... You can do like a Voldemort style thing, so like I snaps the cane head off, and the, obviously you can, you have the snake head here, so it's, it's a bit closer to it. I like the fangs, and like this, I don't know what this whole thing is here. I can make this into like a water pistol, and you can just shoot out like venom, and I'm joking. That'd be um, a stupid idea. But yeah, it's a really cool wand. Uh, then you get the little brackets as well. But yeah, let's actually put them back together because kind of um almost broken before and that wouldn't be a good thing. Um so just put them back like that. Really much. Now the wand like this is basically kind of like when um Voldemort snaps the wand in, snaps the snake head off. Uh now this bit wouldn't actually be on it, it'll just be the Brackets over a bit, but yeah, you can hold it like Voldemort. And Voldemort uses it to obviously murder um, Charity Burbage. Um, I think that's what her name is. Yeah, yeah, Charity Burbage. And yeah, and then obviously, when he's obviously having his duel with Harry, when Harry is in the that quadricycle, I don't know what the the bike thing's called uh, that quadricycle thing. Um, the wand actually cracks, and there's like a gold type uh, priory incantatum um, thing that actually comes out of the wand, and yeah, it cracks and breaks, and obviously doesn't work for Voldemort because he didn't actually win the wand. But yeah, this is an amazing wand. I love this wand. A lot. And I need to just fix this one pretty quickly because the bracket things keep coming off. Um, there will also I'm going to talk to you that um, there is I have got a gaming channel uh, called Big Mac Gaming. Um, if you're wondering why it's called Big Mac Gaming, that's my nickname at work. And. Um, so I just stuck with it, and uh, that's my gaming channel. So at the moment, I am doing um, Lego Star Wars. Um, currently, people might not like my Lego Star uh, my Lego Star Wars game, but um, subscribe to Big Mac Gaming. Uh, I will put a link into the description because then obviously then you can go and find the link to my my second channel, and um, yeah. Um, also, there will be reaction videos coming up soon. Um, yeah, so stay tuned. Uh, and hope you enjoy this video. And peace out.